I ever died in the sea. You love everybody? I just you know. Say I love you everybody. More of just a piece of history standing there. Hey, let me, let me ask you a quick question. I can't do the math. Yeah. So what makes America great? <laughs> Many things, I guess. It just if you had to say one, I mean, not to overgeneralize, but you know what I'm saying. I get a lot. Of, I get a lot of answers to this question. That's what the movie's about, basically. <laughs> well, you caught me off guard. <laughs> What's your favorite? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I love these trees. Well, man. I guess a lot of things. I guess the main thing would be uh, we don't have a dictator. We can get out. We can work. Work your ass off. Yeah, we can pay our bills and still enjoy ourselves. Mhm. Mm Good. <laughs> well, I know you got to go. So, what would make America greater? What makes America great? What would make? No, I, yeah, answer that. We don't have a dictator. Okay. I'll take that as your <laughs> your, you your final answer. <laughs> what makes uh love these trees? What would make America greater? Greater, sir. Oh shit! No taxes. <laughs> right. Paying for all their shit. Who's they? Hey, government. What? Uh, let me ask you this, sir. If you had a magic wand, what would you say uh you would do with it? You know, like the three wishes. Well, yeah. What would I do with it? Just your opinion. I mean, just something big. You know, obviously, maybe you want a bigger house, a nicer house, a bigger business, your own business. Yeah, yeah, I could have all that, but... No, it's something bigger. Like, for the country, for America. Well, for, for America, I would... No, I asked him what was the first step. There's always the first step, thousand mile journey, right? I guess I would better myself first. That's a good one. I like yeah. that. Islam is not this. Those, those, whoever is calling himself Christian, more, more uh, Jew, Muslim, they're all is, they're all part of Islam. Islam is an action. It's a process. Process of accepting that there is a higher being. Who has many names? God, Allah. Has many. Oh, it's other names too. The universe is his home and we are living in this. The okay. whole premise of this film is to uh, to focus on America, not the problems, because yeah. we know the problems, right? We're all, we're all aware of the problems, right, yeah. sir? Right, ma'am, ladies? Right, we, everybody's correct, right? We're all aware of the problems. Oh, Connection to God and uh, understanding to each other. Okay, all right, love you. I love that. Anything else you want to say? Well, uh... I think this is the Cane Creek, Cane Creek in North Carolina, near the South Carolina border. <laughs> Universe has an owner and we have to recognize it so we can have a good relationship with the owner. That is the purpose of our existence, not to make money. Would you agree with my friend from Poff Town who calls himself, people call him a redneck, that says we got to get back to thinking about the Lord? Yeah. Okay. So you're, in, you're just some, with somebody very different than you. Yeah. Apparently different. All right. Thank you, sir. Yeah. I love you. I love you too, and man. I thank you for your help. <laughs> it's great because you, what you get what you have to show for yourself is what you put in. I am originally from Turkey. And I think freedom and diversity, the melting pot concept makes America great. Number one, says, in your opinion. Another one is the freedom of religion. And I have first seen... The first one to say that. You would I have seen... people, you're the first one to specify that. Sorry. What will make America greater? You know, America is great. What would make it greater is that if we last centuries and centuries, like many other civilizations in the past, and that, that America has the potential for, which I believe precisely because of the melting pot concept, 
That was one of the first things that they introduced to us when I came here in 1987, I think. You're not and that the other part that. You were is, just a baby when you came. Yeah, 18. The other part is, I think, to make anything, anything last is to stand by our principles. And Your faith traditions unity. like like we all have. Not just faith traditions, human rights, women's rights, kids' rights. It's not civil rights, it's human rights. Exactly. What makes it great as a small business owner, uh, to be honest with you? I mean, it's your opinion. I mean, it's just, you know. There's three and a quarter back. You do what you want to do with it. All right, it. you give that to the girl. Throw it right there, then. Um, nothing in, in this New York State that's it's any good. Yeah, it's, they make nothing. It tips here. Okay, so we're down here in Noisy, uh, Greensboro. How do you say this bar? Westerwood? Mm -hmm. Westerwood, okay. I can never find it. Okay, so uh, we have a victim here. More than 98%. So here's the first question, dear. Y'all might have to call you dear. Okay, some ladies get offended. Um, what makes America great? I'm trying to be positive. Think of the positive. It's feelings. a positive thing. Fist bump. It's about solutions. Right. A lot of things we call problems are actually symptoms yeah. of a greater problem, which is actually greed. You never know. So. I love getting the face. You're so thoughtful. I'm trying to process. I, I, I don't think America is great at this point. You got all the power. I it's mean, up to you, girl. Yeah, I know, but it's just like. It, it, you say it like it's simple, so yeah. Well, it's a, it's a, it's a you know it's a hypothetical question. Right? Obviously. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But it's it's. You know, you don't have that. I can't give that to you. Um. Just like I can't give you. You can't. Dollars. You no. can't give me a magic wand. I can give you hope. That's all I sell. And um, uh, <clears throat> a thought process that goes on in your mind. I already have a lot of that. I'm sure you do, but I mean, this question. Makes you think, don't you? Yeah, because it's. And you said you're a thought. It's, it's, sure it's, it's systematic. It would be systematic change. That's the first thing I would do is systematic changes. Okay, hey, what's the first step? You, you define the solution, systematic changes, and you said about, you know. Creating what? space for individuals to be heard, creating dialogue and including individuals that whatever decision it is, Whoever it most affects should be at that table. Social work for at least five, six years. Out of um, college or? Yeah, I mean. Masters? I, yep, I got my master's. Yeah, you gotta have that to make any dollars. Yeah, you barely yeah, still the, make any. Uh, uh, <laughs> um, no, I mean, I've been, I've been working for nonprofits for six years. It's great. Yeah, and um, that's. That's where I feel true to myself and true to others. You know, I serve the extreme vulnerable populations that really nobody wants to work with. Would you consider those the hopeless? That they're, you know, like people don't go for, apply for jobs, they're not included in the, uh, the unemployment rate because they stop looking for jobs? So this is Zeke down here at uh, whatever, and he's got an awesome flag, <laughs> blue on white, right? There are 54 states. There you are. And uh, so what makes America great? Uh, My friend Zeke. Let me get a little closer to you because it's hard to hear the wind. Yeah. Diversity and inclusivity. Exit. Inclusive. Can you say that again? Inclusivity. Inclusivity. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. What's your? I just. Uh, I kind of know what it means. But what's your definition of that? Um, that everyone is. Everyone has their own past, everyone has their own story, and that everyone is own experience. allowed to, yeah, exactly, that everyone's allowed to um, define themselves as American, uh, regardless of, I guess, everyone's characteristics. I like that. No, I don't want to buy it. I'm just, I'll tell you what I'm doing, dear, real quick. Greater. Greater okay. than it is today. Say it's great today, make it greater. Um, I, I don't know if I could give you the answer to that it's your you opinion know, it's, sir. A, uh, it's not that you have the answer <laughs> it's just your opinion uh if, that's all you can go from your opinion uh, there we are uh i'd say that it, it will probably 
be something surrounding people being able to have their own opinion and be able to share their own opinion. Um, like you're doing now. Exactly. You know, so going back to the First Amendment, everyone being able to what embrace is the First Amendment? And, uh, I so well, freedom of speech. Okay. You know, for me. Um, the South stood for the Southern states wanting to be free to govern themselves and to make their own decisions and to not to have to cut Washington in on their profit. That was what it was really about. That people are able to express who they are, uh, no matter how they identify. Um, May, can I just interject? Sure. How they are identified. How, well, they, I would are, say, how they are grouped and segregated and well, I marginalized would say how, and put how, in a box. I would say how they identify. Who's they? Um, it just anyone, how I identify. Okay, how you, uh, I, yourself. Yeah, uh, the personally, but nobody's judging you. Is that that's not what you mean? Precisely. Yeah. Exactly. That it, it has more to do with how I identify myself, how you identify yourself, and so that would make it greater. I don't. Yeah. I don't follow every, your line it, of reason. I'm kind of, kind yeah. of slow. What? <laughs> I'm sorry. I mean. Yeah. No, you go right ahead. I mean, so just boil that down for an idiot like me. <laughs> uh, I think that we as a nation are in a, a point of. No, 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 you're going negative. Uh, well, no, no, it's, it's, it's a not, positive it's video. Not, it's not, it's I'll not let you negative. go, but I'm just, I'm saying, I'm, that just saying, I'm looking for solutions. A, a point of division um, in that what I'm looking for is unity, in that people are allowed to embrace who they are and feel comfortable in who they are and not be persecuted for that. Cool. There you go. That cool. was your desire. <laughs> for the look, look at his face. Look at him. Peace. Look at me. <laughs> yeah. Peace. So you just... Bam, peace. Can you define that a little bit? Peace. Peace means... Because it means different things to different people. I know, I know, but for me, peace means let people be who they are. That's what he said. It's number one. It's my son. Oh. <laughs> he was raised right. Let people be what, what they are. And um, for us to be able to understand our differences, understand each other, you know, and, uh, you know, everybody socially, culturally, is who they are and where they come from. We need to be I able mean to interrupt. But you, you got the power, sir. Yeah, I got the power. Yeah. So you're gonna bing. So, but, boil, like I asked him, boil it down for me. What would, what would be the end result of peace, 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 peace. <laughs> All right, cool. Po positive peace. Positive peace. Yes. Okay, positive okay. peace. Yes. Positive As peace. Is it not just the absence of violence? Yeah, yeah, violence. Not just the, Yeah. So not just the absence out. of violence, but an absence of all of the the systems that oppress people. Okay, so that'd be going. I do. Can you say that? I do. I do support the silent American scream 98%, right? We love each other? My answer. I don't give a shit. <laughs> we love each other? We love each other, There's bro. soap and water. We love God each bless. other. Here you go. go How about you, young man? Yeah, oh, definitely. <laughs> All right. Most definitely. Peace, y'all. Love you. Yeah. <laughs>